Hey guys, welcome to Metal. So in this video, we are going to look at the pharmacological actions, pharmacokinetics and adverse effects of local anesthetics. So in the previous video, we watched over the classification of local anesthetics, their mechanism of action, what are the factors affecting the local anesthetics. So make sure to watch that video before this so that you will get a better understanding of the local anesthetics. Moving on to the pharmacological actions. So firstly, we will discuss about the actions on the central nervous system. So we have the central nervous system. So most local anesthetics, they cross the blood brain barrier and find they cause the initial CNS stimulation followed by the depression. So initially they will stimulate the CNS followed by the depression in the higher doses. So in the low doses what they cause, they cause excitement, tremor, twitching and convulsions. In the high doses they cause respiratory depression, coma and death. So we have a dose dependent toxicity as you can see. Dose dependent pharmacological actions. So in the low doses they cause excitement tremor, twitching and convulsions and again in the high doses they cause respiratory depression, coma and death. So this is about the central nervous system actions of the local anesthetics and what are the effects of local anesthetics on the peripheral nerves. So in the peripheral nerves they mainly uh, they, they mainly attain the function of autonomic fibers more than the somatic fibers and firstly they will cause a sensation of the pain, pain will go away first followed by the temperature, followed by touch pressure and finally the motor functions of the uh, given organ so this is about the effect on the peripheral nerves the pain pain will go first compared to temperature touch pressure and finally the motor functions so this is about the pharmacological action of the local anesthetics in the central nervous system so moving on to the cardiovascular system what is what are its effects on the heart so effect on the heart it blocks the sodium channels in the heart thus causing de thus decreasing the abnormal pacemaker activity of the Heart. So it decreases the abnormal pacemaker activity of the heart. It also decreases the contractility. It decreases the conductivity. It decreases the excitability. Followed by it also decreases the heart rate and cardiac activity. So it decreases abnormal pacemaker activity, contractility, conductivity, excitability, as well as the heart rate and cardiac output. Both all of them are decreased. Finally, it increases the effective refractive period. So these are all the effects on the heart of a local anesthetics then we have the other local anesthetics that is called as the pupivacaine and it is cardiotoxic compared to other local anesthetics then we have the lignocaine it decreases automaticity thereby it is helpful in the ventricular arrhythmias as well so moving on to the pharmacokinetics of the local anesthetics so the ester linked local anesthetics they are rapidly metabolized by the plasma cholinesterases and the amide linked local anesthetics they are metabolized in the liver so this is about the pharmacokinetics and they are not effective orally because of the high first pass metabolism so due to high first pass metabolism they are not effective orally so we have the ester and the amide linked local anesthetics right so the ester one are rapidly metabolized by the plasma cholinesterases and the amide linked drugs are metabolized in the liver so moving on to the important aspect that is the adverse effects of the local anesthetics so what are the adverse effects in the cns so firstly we'll learn about the cns adverse effects so what happens as i told you there is initial cns depression depre stimulation followed by depression of the cns so initially they cause restlessness tremor headache drowsiness and confusion and later in the high doses it causes respiratory depression coma and death so as i told you initial cns stimulation followed by the depression of the cns so these are the important adverse effects of the cns of local anesthetics moving on to the cardiovascular system it causes bradycardia and hypotension so as i just told you pharmacology the actions on the cvs so those are all the adverse effects that is the bradycardia and hypotension then it might also cause allergic reactions such as skin rashes itching erythema urticaria wheezing and bronchospasm so it might also cause allergic reactions then it can also cause mucosal irritation such as the cocaine so it can also cause mucosal irritation so these are the important adverse effects of the local anesthetics finally another important topic that is called as the eutetic mixture or is also called as a eutetic mixture of the local anesthetics so example is a lignocaine 2.5 percent plus prilocaine 2.5 percent so combination of these two drugs it can anesthetize the intact skin that is used in the dermal anesthesia so eutetic mixture of lignocaine 2.5 percent and prilocaine 2.5 percent it can anesthetize the intact skin so this is used in the dermal anesthesia so finally finishing the lecture with the thought that is the we don't create the meaning of our life we discover it so this thought, thought is from that book ikigai i have recently read it so i thought it might be helpful we don't create the meaning of our life we discover it 
so thank you guys thank you for watching video till the end make sure to subscribe and hit the like button and share this if you found this helpful to your other friends and people thank you and i'll see you in the next video bye